Hey guys, it's Mike Doyle at Century 21. Tell me if this has happened to you or if you've heard about this happening to some of your friends or family. Buyer is ex super excited about a property. It's their dream home. They put in a crazy offer to get it because they want it so, so bad. And the appraisal comes in low, right? It's happening more and more right now because the market is so hot, there's not enough data to keep up with the crazy high demand, right? So three months ago, a property sells for a million dollars. Today, that prop same property is selling for $1.1 million. And appraisers are always looking at past data. So what happens? How does that work? Well, it's tough, let me tell you. But here's what happens if an appraisal comes in low. Number one, if you are putting 20% down or less, 15% down, 10% down, 3.5% down, whatever. If your appraisal comes in low, it's going to be a big problem. You're going to have to come up with the difference in price that the appraisal came in low at. For example, if you are buying a home for a million dollars and you are putting 20% down, that's $200,000, and you're getting an $800,000 loan. But the appraised value only comes in at $950,000. What that means is that you as the buyer have to bring in that additional $50,000, that's 100,000 minus 950. That's got, you have to bring that into escrow as part of your down payment. Because if you, if you uh, get less than 20% down, typically what happens is your, uh, your uh, interest rate gets a little bit higher or you do private mortgage insurance, something like that. If you are putting more than 20% down, you're okay. Uh, it doesn't really affect anything because interest rates aren't, if you're buying a home to live in, uh, interest rates don't get better above 20% typically. So a couple things. Um, if you don't have that extra cash to put down, you have to get an entirely new appraisal. And to get a new appraisal, unfortunately, you have to get a new lender. Um, so two things can happen there. You either negotiate the price down with the seller to avoid you know, starting over basically. But in today's market, that's gonna be really hard to do. So what a lot of people are, have been doing is they have to get a new appraisal, which means they get a new lender and they start over from zero. So that's what happens if an appraisal comes in low. Hopefully it doesn't happen to you. And truly, once you have your, if you, if you know that you've paid a lot of money for the home and there might be any issues with the appraisal, I always recommend you as a buyer be there, have the buyer's agent be there with comps, supporting your price. Uh, because if you can meet the appraiser at the property, you know the odds may be a little bit better that you can bring it in at value. All right, uh, if you like what you hear, Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Uh, I'll be uh, I'll be giving more of these videos as the year progresses. Thanks.